Hello, I'm in the city, so you might hear some city sounds. And these are our, our thoughts, thoughts on, on beer. beer. I'm with my friend. The sexy homeless. And my name is Mike Trench. We're going to guide you on this experience of a hardcore fucking debate, asshole. What do you have to say about cerveza, huh? You want to say the... Oh, sorry. You want to disrespect my beer? Then my cerveza? I can't, I can't yell because we're in the city, like I said, next to um, a dumpster. Can I, can I say it? A dumpster. Next to a dumpster. We almost got dumped by the trash man, but we <laughs> survived. So, uh, whatever, yeah, hard whatever, debate. What the fuck do you have done. to say about my cerveza, huh? Oh, I Pendejo. think... Cara de rata. I think <laughs> it doesn't really matter whether it's beer or any other kind of alcohol. I think that originally it was made for cooking. And then, of course, wine and rum was made for more medical uses. But it was never really made to be drunk. What do you mean beer was made for cooking? Well, originally alcohol in general was made in a primary way of the cook. It was never meant to be consumed as alcohol like this. No, the pirates? Like, what? Did the pirates, pirates drank beer? The pirates did drink a little bit, but the whole original invention was to use it for cooking as a flavor. It was never meant to be consumed like this. I mean, they're trying to get fucked up, you know. Okay, that, and I know well, that. pirates, of course, they want to get fucked up because they don't give a shit about, about a whole lot of things. You know, the pirates back then were robbers. Uh, you know, beer I mean, bandits. Was used for cooking? What the fuck? Yes, I mean, you never heard of beer battered shrimp, beer battered chicken. There's a lot of recipes no, because in the beer. They had beer into it. They put beer into the pan with oil. Like in the burger, like when I cook a burger, I could add a little bit they're, of. Um, they're beer. supposed to put the grease in the beer into the pan. And fry it up, and then you could, then you could also put beer. Can you, and, and, can you get closer? Sorry. To, um, um, you can also put beer um, and mix it in with the flour, and batter it up that way too. Or also put in oil in the frying pan and fry it up like that too. Heat it up slowly, like you would with oil, but you're mixing yeah. it with beer, and then you can put that on there. Same thing with other alcohols, you can. But I mean, yeah, like I said, in general, it was, it was supposed to be meant for cooking. That's why when consumed, of course, you want to get fucked up. Sure, drink it. But but again, you know what I mean. It, it was never meant for that. So I mean, I don't I don't think p p the people are bad for drinking it. I just think th 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 they're just using it out of, out of context at this point. Yeah, I, because it, it's super addictive, man. All the bad things seem to be if you think about it. I have a hard time, you know, just finding it in my heart to quit it. it well, that's the government's way of of turning you into puppets. Any way they can make money, and addictive. Like like now, if you eat a burger, you go, man, I need another burger. Because they're adding a way for it to no, be addictive. No, but this is like a drink. This you is know? something that tastes like crispy, you know, fizzy. Well, I mean, personally, it smells like poison in my opinion. And I'm not saying that you're wrong for On choosing somebody's to drink breath it. or something. Sm or smell or the, if you smell the liquid, but it's, it's the, the, a different, uh, it's acquired taste. It's a different a type of poison in my opinion, sure, but... I'm not saying it's a it's it, the, the person Beer is bad. It's not fucking poison. It, they it, are it, not it, sipping poison. Right it's it's a it's a watered down. Look, look, at, I, look at those old ads. I say I do, say do poison. They, do they look like not, they're sipping poison? I'm not saying that, that it's literally using this poison. This is the one, poison. What what I'm talking about is that is that to our bodies it is a form of poison. Look at this for your lighthearted moments. You know to give you a heart attack for your lighthearted moments. And of course I'm not saying that that it's literally a bottle of anthrax. You know what I'm saying is that to our bodies it is indeed being consumed and hurting our bodies like poison. I mean, it it's well more be. the uh, antichrist. But I'm just saying though, yes, beer is more watered down than other alcohols are. So of course it may not be as strong. No, they say scientists but um, were we... once saying that it was healthy for you. A guy yeah, that drank. Yeah, but scientists will tell willing... you anything. <laughs> and no, but they're willing. They're, uh, you see, I knew you were gonna say. So I, I don't mean it rudely. Saying, be saying that. I don't mean it rudely. <laughs> I mean, you know, yeah. I mean, sure. I mean, I, I'm sure there are, there are certain things in beer that can be healthy. Maybe certain ingredients, but the drink overall yeah, is, is probably blood, not. It makes your blood thinner, thinner. But I mean, if we're gonna talk about alcohol in general, that's healthy for you. Wine is probably red wine is probably the most healthiest for yeah, you you're right. when drunken and. And certain, um, you know, levels, it, I think it's, it, it can make it's your heart healthier. One, it's one to two cups. It, it's it. Well, we, we're supposed to only take one, technically speaking, but you could probably no, do it's two. One or two. Well, or, or two, depending on their size, what, I'm what, sure. What, what, what? But it's supposed to increase your life by at least a year or so, at least, it, because it's supposed to um, make your heart healthier, apparently, which which it, uh, it affects the blood or some crap like that. I don't remember exactly, but it does involve the heart and, and but lifespan. But it has to be like a good red wine. Not some, uh... But, I mean, uh, but but then again, um, I know that there are more hardcore alcohols than beer. I'm not saying beer is the worst. 
But I am saying that there are healthier things to drink, by far, I mean. But, but again, I mean, I know a lot of cold people that drink. It doesn't mean that they're bad people, but we are allowing ourselves to get ahead of ourselves, and it is resulting. You don't pee right here, do you? Nope. Oh, thank the um, Lord. I just put my pipe down there. Usually I do it right there in the corner, but I throw water on it when I wake up. Oh, Lord. Fucking Jesus. It's good. You're good, though. I put water on it already. But here's the whole thing, though. Yeah, man. It's just that a, a lot of deaths... Um, I, got a, I got my shirt over hmm. my face. A, a, a lot of deaths are occurring because of beer on top of it. So, I mean, Where? obviously... Drunk driving, dude. A lot of people... Oh, go, drunk driving? A lot of people drink, and it, it apparently impairs their mind enough to where, to where they can't think for themselves anymore. So, yes, I mean, and, and of course, I'm not saying that, that, that they drunk too little. And I'm sure you have to um, drink enough amounts. Smell best. You know what I mean? To drink a certain level of it to fuck your body up, sure. But the whole problem of, of, of them having to set a poison level, you know what I mean? The whole intoxicating part of it is why also why I call it poison. That proves in itself that it's bad to some extent. You know what I mean? Like, like for instance, with weed. I don't completely agree with that either, but at least with weed, no one's ever crashed their car or drunk or drive drunk, you know, and rent somebody. You know what I mean? It's 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 a lot harder to to crash a car when you're doing weed. You know what I mean? Like I think it's bad for your liver, you know. Uh, yeah, actually, yeah, um, beer. Well, I mean, not just beer, but yeah, beer is also bad for your liver to an extent. Yeah, I think like that's the thing that's making me want to stop is all the beating on my liver. But if you think about it, though, that I'm doing, I was, I'd be thinking about it. And I'm like, like, uh, it's just because of music. I love sipping a little bit of beer, writing music. Well, that's the whole thing, right? And, and and beer in its own, like, here's the thing. But I should get healthy. I should we stop can't doing it, like, just all the blame time. beer though for these problems. That we have to we have to blame the people who drink it. You know what I mean? It's just like, hey, bro. Exactly. You know what I mean, yeah. don't drink so much. But here's the problem with it, though, right? It's it's still addicting. The problem with it being addicting. That's what I'm saying. Is is that you go, well, I'm gonna sip a few now, I'm good. But then, then then like a few months later or so, you're like, well, gee, I need I need a whole. I'm feeling worse today. Now 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 I need a whole. Hit bingo. I, I, I need a I need a whole. Bingo. Well, see, I need a whole can now because I'm stressed. And then you go, well, shit, I feel better than I ever did drinking a whole can. I'm gonna start drinking whole cans now. And then yeah. you're gonna feel even worse one day. You're like, well, shit, I need two cans. It's just going to build up. So, exactly, I mean, yeah, okay. you know what I mean? And that's the whole problem that we, we have to, you know, in, in the brain, um, basically, we build our own versions of vaccines. We drink so much that our body's used to it now. So it's just like taking medicine. Now we need more of that, a, a more heavier dosage. And that can lead to us dying for not careful. Even, even, even something as, as watered down as beer. You know, so I mean, what's the point of even touching it? Look at the way they used to present the shit, too. Exactly. I mean, and they always present it as people having fun. Again, the yeah. government wants to make money. That's what they do. So any way they can get us hooked on something, that's what they want. They dumb us down to eventually get rid of us, and that's less money they got to put out. Yeah. I'm just being realistic. It's not what people want to hear. It's what they need to hear. That's re realistic. And that's why I'm saying, why even take the first few sips if, you know, like with me, I'd, r I'd rather deal with my pain every day, and it's hard. Did you ever drink beer? Nope, um, I drunk wine or, I mean, one glass of wine or a shot of something that isn't beer for um, f once a day, so every day, never, for six days. And then the seventh day, I noticed that I went to take a piss. I looked in the mirror and I realized that what I was looking at was not myself. I, w I mean, no, I was there, but I wasn't, you know, I mean, I felt like I wasn't there anymore. What do you mean by that? Like when you look in a mirror, you see a reflection, right? But you know that that's not you. Your face is there, but you're not there anymore. You're somebody. You're turning into somebody else, right? So I decided that. What I, you mean, like your face is getting older? No, my my face is exactly the same, right? But but my body behind that face is not me anymore. I'm becoming somebody that 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 I that I not just only you want a bigger body. No, like like okay, when you consume alcohol, you know, what I mean, I notice that and I'm not usually a drinker, but I'm becoming somebody that I hate, a person that is not me, and, and a person I don't want to be. And when I notice that, I'm like, bro, I have one chance. To get out of this. Did now, you have like a like a you know? like a dying wish, like something no. like that you were just purposely fucking? Not purposely. Here's the thing, though. I when I was in high school, I was in a home for a little bit, you know, with my parents for a oh, little but bit. But were you purposely like? I wasn't oh, purposely. I purposely no, I was doing it because I, I, my my back felt good. It felt good to be out of pain. I'm like, well, shit, it's working. Something's working for a change. Let me do this. And then when I looked in the mirror, finally, I'm like, bro, if I don't, I have one chance, and I knew that I had one chance only. If I didn't stop now. I was going to regret it, that's, and that's why I haven't had a drink in over three years, or four, actually for four years, I think, so far. Um, yeah, but I won't touch liquor ever again. You know what I mean? I know better, and I know that that was my only chance to get out of it, you know? And just from that experience alone, you know what I mean? I know that the people shouldn't be touching it. I know, man. It's a poison. It's just, it's you know? poison. It's fucking addictive as fuck.
it's harder to be a good person. It's easier to, to just let go and be bad. And that's why everything that I do, I work so hard at it. You know what I mean? And, and I would like to see, a, you know, I don't like seeing my friends drink because I know what it can do to you. Mm-hmm. And, and by the time you realize it, it's probably too late. So even yeah, though, the, you know, even though, even like, though you, come see, on, Mike, yeah, you see people drink enjoying a beer themselves. With me. That's all right, man. Fuck it. But, but that's, a, you know what? It, it's a, it is all right. But there's you, a saying, it's, it's, though. You, you shouldn't be drinking it every day. Pleasure is deadly. I think every day, or maybe like you know in that? the afternoons is fine, but not not in the mornings during the day. I think. Well, I mean, yeah, but that's fine though. But not you set, in the mornings, every day. But you set the <laughs> bar for, for something, and then you're gonna eventually raise that bar again. Like as, as I told you before in the video. No, that's why you have to control you know? it. But again, addictions are hard to control. You, you make no, a habit, it's control hard to break it. it. But it, that's the whole point. If you if you want to have it, you can have it, but you have to control it. Some yeah. some are not gonna be able to control it, but then that's on them. I see yeah. you twitching. You're like, ah, my God, knowledge. Ah, what is that? No. You all right, brother? I'm good, man. Are you this, stretching? Did this video came out better than I thought, man? It's yeah. Pretty cool. All the Budweiser. Yeah, your body hurts. My body always hurts. We're gonna dog. do. We're gonna do some like running around and exercising. Well, hope that's you what I want to do. And there's like stretching. There's stretching machines over there. But anyways, why don't you stretch on on my playlist? Oh. Check out the playlist between me and the sexy homeless. We own this.